Okay. Hello again. It's me, Beck. Um, I wanted to make another video because something really like crazy and weird and awesome just happened like a couple hours ago. <laughs> and <laughs> and I felt like I don't know, it's it's relevant and I, I wanted to tell you guys about it. But um so I, I, sh I should give you some some background first on it. So um my my family is is here visiting me for uh my graduation, which is which just happened uh last night actually, which is really cool. Yay, I'm an alum now or something. Just graduated college. But um so yeah, they're here visiting my mom, my dad, my sister who's couple years older than me, she's 24, and my aunt, and, um, and, uh, <clears throat> this, this was the first time that I was going to be seeing them since coming out to everyone, because I said in la my last video that I, I just came out, like, a couple months ago, I guess, roughly, I don't know, two or three, I don't know, but, um, so I was really nervous that, about, like, how they were going to talk to me and address me and refer to me and everything and I was scared that that you know they weren't even gonna try and and they were just gonna be like just butcher it or like deliberately mispronoun me or, or something which um when everyone first got here um that it was kind of I mean, it kind of felt like that, at least, because it, it was immediate, like, she, 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 her, her, you know, um, and, and I, I, I thought, to me, it just seemed like they, they just, like, didn't care, like, they were trying, and they, or, like, they were saying to me, like, no, we're not going to do that, nope, sorry, mm-mm, but, um, and I was prepared for, you know, you you have to try to be like understanding, um, to an extent of you know, people who are like family members and stuff not getting it immediately because, you know, they're used to uh, thinking about you in a certain way and like referring to you in a certain way, um, for their whole lives. It's gonna be hard for anyone to immediately change, but but when it's you know, like, they're, it seems like they're not even trying, it can be, like, really hard and, and uncomfortable and everything, but, but actually, like, over, I mean, since they've been here, we've, um, <clears throat> we've, we've had, like, a couple conversations about it, and, and, and they, they've got, actually gotten a, le a lot better just in the couple days that they've been here, but, um, so, Okay, so the thing that just happened... Okay, first of all, my sister... Um, well, okay, I grew up in the panhandle of Florida, which is very southern. <clears throat> my dad is is very, like, traditional conservative southern. And my sister is very, like, daddy's girl. Very, um... Likes pink everything. And purses and painting her nails. And very, like... She's she's a princess, you know. But um, <clears throat> tonight, <clears throat> excuse me, I'm still a little sick. Um, tonight we uh, went out to eat dinner downtown, and uh, we were walking back to the car after dinner, and um, this this car um with all their windows down with a bunch of like big broy dudes in there drove by and as they're driving by they shout something out of the window at us and I, I couldn't tell what it was at first I mean later I learned that or I, my sister was telling me that they were saying something like uh, hey, tell your son you should something that was you know undoubtedly like really offensive and probably homophobic and terrible and um but so so uh at that point I see 
like the car kind of goes forward and they like slow down I guess up ahead to because they want to like park the car or something and my sister right after they say this just bolts in her she has like a you know her pink ruffled top in her like Gucci bag and she just bolts after this car and she runs up to them she catches up with them and she's like what did you say about my brother what did you say about my brother and I was just like oh. I was like what what and it was it was weird because it was like this thing that these people were saying like terrible things to me but it, it was like such a touching moment because like okay first of all it was really cool because they were like tell your son da 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 which like that's okay that's the first time that that strangers have have read me as male which that's awesome but but then my sister is all like my brother and I just that's like not anything close to I, I, I wasn't expecting anything close to that from this trip and it was it was just really really great and I felt like you know accepted and and <laughs> I, I just like I didn't know what to say afterwards I was just like oh my god this is amazing and of course my my like <laughs> My mom and my nana were, I mean, my dad was cracking up because he was like, that's my girl or whatever, talking about my sister, like running up to them and being like, what? Because they were, they were like scared of her. These dudes in the car, they were like, oh shit, oh shit, drive away. She was all like, but my dad was like laughing, but my mom and my nana were, um, I guess my nana came down to my grandma who like, I, she lived with us, um, when I was growing up in the house um but they were all like Connie why you gotta be careful you can't just do that you know people have guns they can uh. but <laughs> I don't know it was just a really funny sight my sister this like very girly girl like princess being like why did you like running up to this car yeah anyways but yeah it was just it's really cool like feeling you know a couple days ago like they were you know deliberately trying to be like no we're not going to accept this um identity and we're going to try to like i don't know it feeling like they were deliberately getting it wrong going from that to to like you know accepting me and like trying because they are trying now and it's, it's, I can tell. I really appreciate it. And like, okay, last night at, <clears throat> at, um, after graduation, when I was like hugging all of my family members and everything, I, uh, I went to hug my dad and he looks me right in the eye and, and like sticks out his hand for me to shake. And I felt like it was kind of his way of, of trying to tell me, like, I'm trying to accept this, this, you know, it's trying to be accepting of you or whatever, and, you know, because that's a very, like, father-son thing to do, you know, so we, like, shook hands, and I'm, I think that, you know, there was the recognition of, like, I don't know, but it, it was... It's just really cool, and and the the guy I'm dating, who I mentioned in my last video, drove down to to be at my graduation, which is really wonderful of him. So he didn't have to do that, but he's a really great guy, and it made me very happy. And yeah, so and he's actually driving back down tomorrow morning to help me move all my stuff out of my dorm off campus so that's really great and 
yeah, overall I just feel like it's been a really good past few days, despite, you know, the stuff at the beginning of the visit, where I was feeling very uncomfortable and anxious with all the mispronouning and everything. But, but yeah, so, okay, well, that's, that's what I wanted to say, so, yeah. So, okay. Well, until next time, goodbye, YouTube. Ha <laughs> ha.